Timber Horses were the project for the 2019 Port Townsend School of Woodworking Timber Framing course in Module 1. That's the introductory week. Right after that, they jump into the Build a Structure course, which is three weeks long. And this year, they took on a challenging project. The project is an octagonal pavilion for Children's Hospital in Seattle and it's designed by Terrapin Architecture. Our lead instructor, Abel Dances, explains part of the project. What we're doing right now is we're basically proofing the entire okay. roof system no, in, in real space, full size. These are actual, actually, this lower section we have it fits great. We've got seven other sets just like it, so it's great to set it up and, and check that the math worked. Um, this upper framing is a little complicated. <laughs> it's, uh, it's not only hip framing, but it's curved. Um, there's no post, there's no central hub, so we have a compression ring at the very top, like a yurt. This mid girt here, or header, is a housed compression ring as well. Yeah, out here the the perimeter girt has uh, cog joints to handle the tension, so it's, it's very strong. Um, and what folks in the other room are doing are actually fitting curved knee braces that will connect the perimeter girt and the log columns. The log columns themselves often also have a large knee or a strut that connects with the diagonal hip rafters here and it forms sort of a truss that holds the, the building up so everything interlocks and is derived from a hard math number at cardinal points uh, and then it's up to us to just be consistent in between. In 2020 the structure will be assembled in the gardens outside Children's Hospital in Seattle.